everybody. A rather wet and rainy one, unfortunately. <laughs> Heidi and I have come away for a night together. We are staying in the village of Painswick, which is in the northwest corner of the Cotswolds. It's a really, really lovely little village, which like many in the Cotswolds, made its money through the wool trade during the medieval times. So it's a place that I haven't actually been, although I've seen a lot of photos and heard a lot of really lovely things about it. So Heidi and I are venturing out in the drizzle to have a look around the village and then we're going to check into our hotel for the night, the Painswick. So one thing that the church here in Painswick is famous for is its yew trees. How many yew trees are there here, do you think, Heidi? 99. 99, that's right. There's 99 yew trees here. All lined around. Heidi's found one that's got two colours, a two-tone yew tree. That, uh, that's a hyacinth. Oh. And then these little ones here, they're called grape hyacinth. Elephant. And the daffodils. Do you make purple and yellow make purple? Do they? have just arrived at the Painswick Hotel in the northwest corner of the Cotswolds where me and Heidi are staying for the night. We are in George's suite. Really pretty, isn't it? Yeah. What's through this way? Should we have a little look? Oh, bedroom. Bedroom. That's the bedroom. I, I, why is the bed so big? Because it's luxury for you and me tonight, my little one. Yes. Isn't it nice? TV. It's huge. TV. We've got our own TV. TV. Oh, lovely. Oh, we've got a nice little water bottle here. Hot water bottle. That's nice. Oh, those are really pretty above the bed. All the dried, dried flowers. They're so nice. I like them. Right, what is in here? Living room. Our living room, isn't it nice? And a tuff and a feather. Oh, a little white feather. Oh, oh. Where it came from. We like I collecting little white feathers, don't we? Yeah, and I found it on the pillow. Good little omens. A nice big fireplace. I wonder if we can start it. Oh, we can as well. Yay. Oh, that might be nice for later when it drops cooler. We've got a balcony through here. We've got a balcony? Yeah. Ooh. Let's have a look. I've got no food on. Ooh, we have as well. Oh, look at those views. Look, 
have we discovered? Binoculars. Binoculars. That'd be good for looking out on the balcony. Can see for miles already, let alone with those. Dear Stacey, Peter and Heidi, on, on behalf of my team, I'd like to wish you a very warm welcome to the Painswick. And then through bathroom. here, the bathroom. That's it, we missed the bathroom, didn't we? The best place of all. The best place. Oh, oh, hi, hi, fish fingers. Ooh. Fish fingers is used in the bathroom. Big roll top bath. Huh? Yeah. Fish fingers, Gross. oh yes. <laughs> he was sitting room next to the toilet. Are you happy, happy? Yes, yes. What's your favourite bit? The bedroom. That bed balcony looks so com. Oh yes, the balcony. And this place, uh, the living room. The living room. It's all so pretty. See, they've left mummy and daddy a little prezzy. Welcome. Wishing you all an enjoyable stay. Best wishes. Thank you. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. Shall enjoy that later. What have you found here? Oh, it's especially for you. What does it say? Hello, me. Hello, me. Dip, dip, dip me in warm milk to make a delicious hot chocolate at bedtime. Cool reception on a on zero warm, on zero for warm milk. Oh, <gasps> that's gonna nice. be nice, isn't it? He's got a little mocktail. Well, we have woken to a bit of a rainstorm this morning. And from what I've seen of the weather forecast, this is going to be how it looks for the rest of the day. Heavy rain. So we are gonna go down, have some breakfast, and then I think we'll finish up here in the hotel. So what we want to do today is go to Painswick Rococo Gardens, which, um, as far as I'm aware, I haven't been at this time of year, but as far as I'm aware and as far as I've seen, have a really, really gorgeous display of snowdrops. So the hotel has got us tickets to enter there and it's just a couple of minutes down the road. So we're gonna drive down to Painswick Rococo Gardens, have a look at the snowdrops. And then from there, I have another few places on my list, but we'll see what we can fit in because as far as I'm aware, the weather isn't going to be the greatest today, unfortunately. I think it's supposed to be quite heavy rain. So 
we will head head down for breakfast, get some food, go to this garden and take it from there, I think. Right, we've just come down for breakfast. Dominoes. Oh yes, I remember. And then we <laughs> imagine setting up a really, really long one. They do some really intricate ones, don't they? Yeah. Have you seen them on YouTube? now for breakfast and we've remembered that Heidi's got this really lovely hot chocolate so we've got a cup of warm milk <coughs> shall, we? shall we make us a hot chocolate yes. that's it let's stick it let's tear all around I'll give it a little whizzy whiz The hot chocolate potion. Oh, look, it's going. How's your hot chocolate? That's really good. Is that all gone? My goodness. Some daffodils. All right, setting off. Thank you for a wonderful stay. Right.
right, just a couple of minutes down the road and we are at our stop, Painswick Rococo Gardens, which is a wonderful Italianate style garden almost with some really beautiful architectural pieces. But as I say, today we are here for the snowdrops. We've been given an ice by trail. What have we got to find, Heidi? Um, the rusty hen. Rusty hen. The stone fireplace. The caterpillar carving. The spy hole. And the trickling steps. The trickling steps. The oh, they look cool. Yeah. Right. Let's have and a hunt. Of course, let's see what we can get. And of mom's course, favorite. Mummy's favourite. Mummy's favourite. What are they? Snowdrops. Snowdrops. <laughs> That's this. That is apparently why here we have come here. Mm, see, see the, the snowdrops. So this is the Red House. No guesses where that name came from. One of a couple focal points around the garden. We have just heard an owl. Like a little owl. Like a little owl. Are you sure it wasn't a big owl? I said a literal owl. A literal. Oh, a literal owl. They said a little owl. A literal it owl. Might be a little owl. It might be. It might be a big one. Most owls are little. Not on your I spy? No. no. Okay. Do you want to go in? Come on then. I have just discovered that this cute little red house is actually a wedding venue. So you can get married here with these beautiful views. So lovely. They make a very beautiful wedding venue. You need a very small wedding party though because it is small, very, very small inside. Well, it looks like we have arrived a little too late for the snowdrops. Unfortunately, they are all past it. But what we do have are lots of daffodils and loads of beautiful, beautiful hellebore. There's a lovely collection of hellebore here. Badger hole. badger hole. Oh, badger hole. My goodness. Look at all those daffodils. Oh, they're looking so lovely. Let's get closer to those. We found some leucosium. popping up in here. Look at this. They're everywhere. Tulips, daffodils, all sorts. This is going to be amazing in a few more weeks. Mom. 
So this is the Exedra Garden. The garden here at Painted Rococo dates back 250 years. And this focal point here in the middle is 18th century, made of wood and lime plaster. Somebody sounds happy taking photos. So we have found the plunge pool, kept at a constant 12 degrees. Heidi, do you want to dip your feet in? Mm. <laughs> Maybe mm. not. Mm. Yeah, part of the 18th century health regime was the cold plunge, as it is today, I suppose. It's constantly topped up by the spring water, which is running. You can hear it. We have found some snowdrops, although they have definitely seen better days. This would have been so, so, so pretty with all these snowdrops. There's only a few left now, but with that view looking back up to the house as well. That would have been so beautiful a week ago. Shall we get going? Rain has started again. And it's a red chill.